So you want to go to usendit.com. And uh, this is the main page. Um, let me just quickly show you the, the plans and the free trial that they have. So as you can see here, they have uh, several packages, uh, the Lite Pro, Pro Plus, and Corporate Suite. Um, I personally have been using the Lite one because it's free and it gives you a maximum file size up to 100 meg. It doesn't offer any sort of uh, uh, tracking mechanism, uh, but it's uh, it's really good enough if you just uh, you know want to get the the file across. It does offer you retain received and it's per uh, per uh, pay per used. So yeah, I think you have to pay like thirty or thirty five cents for each file. The uh, other packages that they offer is the Pro Pro Plus and Corporate Suite and again as you, you can see their prices here uh, basically those packages give you more um, maximum file size and offer some tracking mechanism and some other support so let's go back here um, <clears throat> so this tool is actually pretty simple to use um, all what you have to do is put in the from email address which is your email address in this case so I'm just gonna say support at getmybizready.com and in this for the purpose of this demo I'm gonna use again to support at getmybizready.com and then the next step is to select the file you're sending. So I'm just going to use uh, a small file in this case, just for this demo. And you have an option of uh, specifying subject and a message if you want to. And then subject, let's say. going to leave the message blank and say send it and now it's going through the process of uploading the file again as you can see this is pretty small uh, file but you could send up to 100 meg in this uh, uh, free light package and then it's off asking me if I want to be notified when the file is downloaded for three ninety nine, and I'm gonna say no. And it's done. Uh, this is the link to your file. Uh, file ex expiration date January fourteenth. So the receiver of this file has until January fourteenth to. Um, to go ahead and download the file and here it's uh, <coughs> it's asking me if I want to create an account or not and it's it's really a good idea to go ahead and create your own account that way you could uh, log in and see your uh, your history um, you know history of all the files that you have sent and, and